Hello, this week coming from Stanley Park in Gosport. It's lovely, it's been a baking hot afternoon in the sunshine. It's actually nice to get out in the coolness of the shade of the trees. So, uh, yes, recently, last weekend, but this is going out in a couple of weeks time, met up with the Worthing boys, that's Tony and Terry, and they came over to Fairwell where I picked them up. Um, on the train and I picked them up in my car and we drove up to Orsford, New Orsford station which is where the uh, Watercrest line goes from. Now they've got some loads of steam and diesel trains there. It really is a train spotter's delight but it is so nostalgic. I've been on it once before and that was a couple of Christmases ago that they do their illumination train and it really is just spectacular. Never done it uh, at a day on the train sort of thing. So we joined the train at New Orsford. We went just one stop, which is about 15 minutes away to Ropley where we got off and uh, we were, you'll see how fantastic Ropley was. There's a little miniature railway there we went on. It goes for about a kilometer and then there's a lot of nostalgia there with the workshops and you can even there's dressing up boxes as well it was fantastic it was great fun and lots of things for kids to do as well uh, coloring in um, uh, spittle fix or whatever it's called um, bricks um, yes uh, absolutely fantastic uh, we then got back on the train the next train and we went to Alton we had a little walk around, did a little bit of shopping and grabbed a rather fast coffee because time was running out. And the last train left Alton at four o'clock, which we got on. And that was actually quite busy. Um, a few little naughty children there, a big group of kids really, quite young, so about four or five, being allowed to jump all over the seats by the elders, shall we say, the guardians. Hmm. Wouldn't have got away with it in my day. Wouldn't have got away with it, me, with me. <laughs> and we went all straight all the way back to New Orsford. And we were going to have a picnic, which the boys have very kindly prepared. I just bought the drinkies. Um, in the New Orsford Memorial Park. But it appeared that you can only get to it by foot. If you know different, then please leave your comments below. And uh, so we drove in the end to Portsdown Hill just north of Portsmouth, which had glorious views over Portsmouth, the Solent, and the Isle of Wight. I then took them back to Haven Station, and what a glorious day it was. Something to reflect on, and I think for all of us, made us feel old in remembering how stations used to look in our childhoods and our younger days, and uh, oh, how wonderful the furnishings, the decor, and indeed the trains, although I don't remember steam trains, but the carriages were certainly very similar to the era that I used to travel from Surrey up to London with mum on the train. Anyway, here we go. Um, I will make further comments during the vlog, but please feel free to subscribe, like, share, and love your comments below. Take care. Speak to you shortly.
Holy shit. What noise does it make?
do lose the loop in a minute. <laughs> Really? It's guarantee the headline in the local press. It's a stuffed cat. Oh, look at the picture. Can I fix your back pocket? Another fully specific arrived in the shape of three four oh six seven hangers. As with many others, it's hang me. By now there were four fully specific from the scrapyard of Barry with everything glass. Hang there would be the hundred and eighteenth to leave the yard. The Yuri Group even managed to get the T9 from the National Collection in 1981 and would get the locomotive steamed again in just two years. This unique engine was still in its light green livery as applied it easily in the 1960s for special. They've even got lifelike models from the age and the era. They've, got, they've even got lifelike models from the age. Uh, what do you mean? I'm filming Terry. It had always oh, been right. the long-term aim to extend the line to Alton when funds permitted. Is that real? Fortunately, the land had been purchased right. in 1976 with this in Oh, yeah. <laughs>